Hello guys! So, because the last video was sort of about how I had a series of really bad days and how I needed to cheer myself up, I wanted to let you know that Fridge the Llama did I have a really good day today. Fridge the Llama. So in case you were wondering, a good day for me normally includes friends, movies, books, a lot of talking, some great food, and some just generally ridiculous moments, and today had all of these things. So I spent the day hanging out with my friend Muda, which you know, but I'll put a link to her channel in the doobly-doo. I also hung out with our friend Sellers, and both of them are nerd fighters who live in Chicago. He's got a channel too, there'll be a link to that down there. We met up because we wanted to go see The Lion King, you know, relive our childhoods, nostalgia, the whole nine yards, and it was totally worth it. I, I really, really love The Lion King. I could quote most of it for them, and I didn't. I was actually a really good movie watcher. I just want to share that. I didn't talk through most of it, which I normally do, and I didn't sing with it, which I always do. So in general, they got a really good Jenna movie experience today. After The Lion King, we decided to go to Half Price Books, and I don't know if you've ever been to a Half Price Books, but don't go in unless you've got some money to spend, because there are some really great finds there. I got um, the only John Green novel that I didn't already have, so I got Let It Snow, which he also does with um, Morgan Johnson and Laura Miracle. And I got The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, and Little Miss Sunshine, and like Muda got Ghostbusters, which is awesome. And Andrew got this entire collection of really cool movies that I can't remember right now. And it was just fun to be able to talk about the books and the movies and stuff that we liked, and to be able to geek out over them a little bit, and have everybody else in the group geek out over them equally. So then from there we decided we wanted to get something to eat, so we went to Red Robin because I've never been to a Red Robin, they don't really have them in Arkansas, and I had a really great chicken sandwich that had like tomatoes and mozzarella and pesto and like, <sighs> it was just really good. <laughs> and their fries are really good, which I guess you didn't have to know. Point is, we had good food. And good conversation while we had the good food, which is always like an extra bonus, right? So from there, we decided we would go back to Seller's house, which is where we all met up. And we hung out for a little while, talked, that sort of thing. Um, I did a lot of my fiction homework, which I actually have to go finish in a couple minutes, so this video is going to be short. But anyway, I did some of my fiction homework. We talked video games, geeked out over Pokemon and Tetris. And in the process, we helped Muda with her A to Z project. She has to come up with a different word for every letter in the alphabet that she can film for her documentary class. So we got to take random footage of things like Andrew swinging a hammer and, you know, a squeegee wiggly ball. You know, just fun, absolutely ridiculous things. Just, it was just great. And then... I came home, and now I'm here, and I'm going to have to do homework, and that's going to make me a little sad, but, you know, there can be tea involved, and I like tea, and maybe I'll pop in Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. But the point isn't really how great my day was, although it was really great. The point is really what makes a great day for you. I mean, does it involve the same things? Do you just like hanging out with friends, having great conversation? Um, you know, does it involve food? Does it involve movies? Does it involve going to your favorite park? I mean, it just, it has to be different for everybody, right? So I want to know, what makes your day great? Yeah, because there are lots of people in the world that are different from me, and I like that. <laughs> so yeah, I will see you guys probably later this week, but we'll see how bad the homework gets.